Okay, choose Haku. First black play. I'll explain the moves. Okay, first black plays here to take this corner. Next, white plays here to take this corner. And probably also to stop this black stone coming over here. But white just plays over there. Okay. And black takes this corner and also connects with this stone, so making a little bit of area here. Then black, white, in order to stop black from going here, white goes here. So connecting these stones and stopping black from going here. Then black takes another corner, connecting this stone. So it's like a little triangle here between them. And then white decides to take this part. Black then takes this part. And then white invades, cutting off these two black stones. Then black goes here, cutting off these white stones, and also sort of surrounding this white stone, and also sort of connecting these two stones. And then white cuts here, disconnecting these two stones, and also what, making like a little wall between this stone and these stones. And then white black jumps out. Good, and there's the game. White jumps out, black jumps out, and then white cuts, blocking these two stones from connecting, then black cuts, blocking these two stones, white connects, and black connects here, and because this part, white wants to sort of connect this stone to make this stone stronger and not let these stones connect, so it cuts him in order not to be taken, black extends. Then white goes down, threatening these stones, black extends. This part's weak in order not to get cut. First white threatens these stones, white goes up. And then he threatens again, black goes up. And then his stone's weak, so he goes in strengthened here. Then he goes attacking that black stone again. Why black, white, black goes up. Then so what's black doing? Black is going towards these stones and sort of making an area around here. White's got a little area here, but these stones are weak. Black's got an area here, but these stones are weak. So white pushes on the weakness in these black stones. Black doesn't cut yet. He sort of defends these stones, attacks the stone. Then it goes down. Black splits because if these connect, they'll become too strong. Black. Uh, white doesn't want black to make an eye here, so it connects. And then this black area is too small to make two eyes, so black goes out. White stops him going further. Then black goes out some more. White cuts. Black defends here. And then white cuts. Then black can't connect because white will just take it, so black starts a cold fight. White takes. Black cuts here, and the white has to respond. And then black takes, and then white threatens to push out and surround these stones. So black says no. And then white takes, and then black threatens to take these stones again. White can't have that. And black takes, and then white threatens to come out. But black doesn't think it's. Black thinks this saving these is more important, so he takes. And white comes out, black goes here. Hmm, he goes here because these stones are weak. He doesn't want to get surrounded, probably. And then that's a nice move by white. That was a nice jump. So it's one more point than if you just went here. And now this part is weak for black, so he wants to strengthen it. But before he does that, he puts pressure on these. White has to respond, then he strengthens. This part here is weak for white. This group's weak, surrounded. So he defends there. And then black jumps out with these stones. And now white wants to jump out to take this area, but first he takes. Black's only got one eye here. So if white goes there, this is dead. So black has to go there to make his two eyes. And then black jumps out here. And then white, uh, black stops white from jumping out. Hmm, and then the white extends here, making more territory. Four spaces in between. And then black pincers this stone. And also cuts off these two stones. And then white 
connects these two stones and also sort of pinches this. Hmm, and then what does black do? Ah, he pinches as well. So he connect he makes this he makes a nice shape here, and he's also pinching this stone here. So white wants to play somewhere here, but before that he jumps out here. Doesn't want these stones getting surrounded. And black jumps out, then white does a big knight jump here. Hmm. Or does he do that first? He either goes here or here. I think he goes here first, and then black. These stones are getting surrounded. This little weak group is getting surrounded, so he pushes out. And then white does that. And then black defends, and then white. goes here, extends the stone, and then black jumps out. And then white extends here, I think. And now black does here, connecting all these little shapes together. And then white panes on the head. Mm. And then black goes here, making a little group, and also threatening to cut this off. White connects. here next no ah, I've got the first move wrong I made it up to 82 without getting a move wrong what happens next mm, this part's quite weak you think he'd do something with this weak group here I think what he does ah, I see once this connects he doesn't go here yet he goes down here yes attacking that stone White panes, black panes, white cuts, black extends, white cuts. And now black ignores it now, black goes up here. Yes. And then what does white do? White pinches this stone, makes this stone strong, it makes a little group here. This part is quite weak. And then what does black do? 